Hey there, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use the trim side bend and offset options in the edge flange tool. Let's start by activating the tool. Here's the property manager and we'll select the first flange in the graphic area. I specify the length of the flange with my second left click. Now let's select a second flange. As you see here, SolidWorks inserts a gap between the edges automatically. We can also set the gap distance here, let's say 0.5 millimeters. Tab to register. Now let's scroll down the property manager, the flange position. This is where we set parameters for an offset. So to use the offset, make sure the offset option box is checked. And here are the four options for the offset. Blind, up to vertex, up to surface, and offset from surface. We can also set the offset distance right in the graphic area by dragging the arrow handles. A left click also sets the offset distance in the graphic area. If you need to reverse the offset direction, just click this button. And I can grab the arrow handles and drag in the right direction as well. Again, a left click will set the offset distance. And let's click Accept. Notice that we've got some extra material right here. Let's remove it. Let's edit the feature. Let's right click on Edge Flange 1 and select Edit Feature. And I'm going to scroll down the Property Manager. Under Flange Position, check Trim Side Bends and click OK. Problem solved. The extra material is removed. And this concludes our video about working with the Trim Side Bend and Offset options in the Edge Flange tool.